Well, I mean, we saw the script, so I guess uh, we know what to expect. Someone get killed or injured or whatever. So, yeah, it's pretty much like a cutscene mission. Despite the glitch, well, I, get, I managed to finish the mission because it was not only cutscenes. But anyways, I'm uh, going to continue playing on our mission, which is uh, the 16th mission over here is a uh, Killer Instinct series made uh, by Monster HG. And the title mission is Goodbye, My Partner. So yeah, we don't waste any further time on like, this mission. Hopefully this mission is going to be longer, man. I'm not really a fan of cutscene only missions. Of course, there's like some exceptions, especially if they're actually long itself, you know. Send for your hospital at 8 a.m. That's outside hospital. I thought it was like, like inside hospital. Hey man, everything's alright? Yeah, we have to go to Los Santos Cemetery. Yo, that's another city, man. What the hell? Don't worry, mate. I swear I catch those man these motherfuckers and put them in jail. Whatever, let's go. I don't understand. No, man. How that happened? I don't know. Just see his blood in everywhere. <laughs> he he tell me that there's an old man shoot him and Steve with that man. Just I want to give yourself some rest, man, and then what? Some rest. Steve is dead because of the, his bitch brother. Still will not rest in his grave. Okay, sorry. Let's drive to Los Santos. Yeah, sounds good. You really want me to go to Los Angeles, right? Oh my god, you, are, you have to be kidding me. Uh, but you know what? I'm going to spend my time driving around between cities, you know. Yeah, that's crazy, man. You have to drive all the way. Like from one major city to another major city. Yo, yeah, for those who didn't know, uh, you know, like uh, the real life kind of part is in Fierro and Los Santos. It's uh, San Francisco and Los Angeles. And like, uh, you know, the time you have to spend driving to reach between the two cities actually like six hours. Now, uh, I haven't done that because I don't leave the, those part of, you know, the country or like uh, the region. You know, I live in Montreal, which is like more like uh, to the east. It's not entirely east coast, but it's like more to the east. So, yeah, it's the same uh, amount of uh, time from Montreal to go to Toronto. So, yeah, but I guess that the speed limit is not the same between like, uh, you know, California and like uh, Quebec and Ontario, you know. Yeah, we use kilometers. Like unlike uh, in the US, they use uh, miles and all that. Oh yeah, and by the way, I should just go to the highway, man. I'm spending my time trying to go to the follow the the checkpoints, but I could have gone to the highway and go around the the whole map itself. Yeah, it's been a while that they make like a new GTA games. Like uh, we're still waiting for GTA 6. Yeah, there's gonna be a lot of things that's gonna be changed uh, from GTA 5 to, to GTA 6. I mean, we don't we're not in the same era, so we don't have the, like the same taste as before and all that, man. So if they're gonna put like the same kind of stuff, like uh, you know the the humor, the memes, and stuff like that, uh, I don't think it's gonna work very well. Like I mean, like uh, you know, GTA Five is made like in 2013, and yeah, the 2010s era is like it's not the same thing. Well, I mean, the 2010s decade is not the same thing as the 2020. And even though like uh, we're 2022, 
you know, like the lifestyle is very different compared to the 2010s already. You know, mainly because of uh, the recent like uh, event, which is COVID pandemic. Yeah, a lot of things change compared to then. All right. Anyways, I'm just going there. But seriously, I, I really would like to have like a GTA that is not like uh, you know based in the US anymore. I mean, the US has a lot of cities, but I don't know, man. I want something different, you know. Yeah, I, I want a GTA in Montreal. And speaking of Montreal, someone uh, like uh, did it, like a fan actually did like a mod of it but it's like it's so small that uh, you, you know yeah it's very small it's much smaller smaller than Liberty City GT3 yeah and the mother what, what he was thinking is about like uh, you know like the the Great Montreal that includes like uh, you know well you don't you guys already know about like uh, Greater Montreal, I mean, like the satellite cities and all that. But yeah, it's the metropolitan area of the city. Yeah, here in Quebec, it's it's uh, pretty much like Montreal and Quebec City that are the most known ones. I'm mean, among like Quebec. Uh, cities province of Quebec cities It'd be great if there's like more cities more major cities like when I say major cities like 1 million people and more but the good thing is that uh, their territory is so big they could expand themselves they're probably like uh, you know some politician that uh, going to put like some uh, restriction and all that, but they still have a lot of uh, they they have lots of way to expand themselves. You won't say it's the same thing like uh, you know like certain parts of the world like uh, you know like in Europe like Paris. Paris it will be hard to expand. I mean this city exists like. Uh, for millennia and it's very hard to expand I mean they could build up with the skyscrapers but uh, to expand beyond their borders it'll be hard it's not the same thing with Montreal Montreal they can expand the thing is that uh, what they will expand it will be mostly like their, their suburbs the city will, will have a hard time to expand because uh, it's pretty much an island. So yeah, and even the even like between the island itself, there's suburbs as well. So yeah, there's more restriction. Okay, here we are. Park your car. Took me a while to get there, by the way. Oh. Okay, I guess I have to go here. There's a good amount of people. Oh, get back to your vehicle. All right, cool. You really want me to park there? All right, cool. Gotcha. Why are you diving that way? Here we are now. Our friend and brother Steve, who near us when we need help, when we have problems. Rest in peace, Steve Wallison. Rest in peace, Steve. Hey Lawrence, who is this girl? I think this is his girlfriend. Yo man, Steve, it's Hero. He can be a good cop. Yeah, he can be a good best friend. So the guy with uh, the Chicago like uh, balls uh, shirt is dead. Hey Steve, I swear I took revenge. I swear I'm going to kill that motherfucker, Steve. What? Red is in peace, brother. Wait, wait, I, I didn't really get it. 
you want to kill Steve, but uh, you're mourning for Steve? Here's flowers. I hope you like it, bro. Hey, who's that guy in the background? I mean, foreground. Rest in peace, my son. Chapter 2 complete to be continued. Which means that's pretty much the end of the mission. Thanks for watching and see you next time, guys.